uh, blew the front end of my radio out or uh, the noise has stopped next door or we're just having a really low noise level tonight. So this is uh, 20 meters. I'm on my 20 meter dipole. Look at that noise level. I've never seen it that low. So that is uh, S1. Uh, parts of this bin. This is CW meter, a little upper side bin. There we go. Look at that noise level. That is basically less than one S unit of noise. And that band scope, look at that. This is uncanny. I've never seen anything like this. This used to be full of spurs, uh, presumably from the grow lights next door. Uh, there's one station here. That sounds like FT8 maybe. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, I'm somewhat worried, but this is the right antenna I'm on. I know this is my 40 meter dipole. When I uh, key up, you'll see it's on power output. And I key up and see that here. And it's on SWR, so I need to put it on power output. And bang, it's 100 watts. Uh, I switch it to SWR. Nothing. So I'm definitely on my fan dipole. It's, it's interestingly enough, if I go to my uh, 14 ABQ vertical, which has a 20 meter segment, that's an antenna two, press and hold. Okay, we go back to side band. That's an antenna two. And uh, basically nothing there. There's some sort of little image things here. But they're pretty suppressed. So they're pretty regular intervals. But nothing like what I was seeing before. Interestingly enough, when I go to uh, 40 meters, I still get these big guys here. Uh, not sure what those are. Those are they could be the grow lights. Uh, could be something else. Let's see, antenna 2. Uh, they're not on, not so much on antenna 2, which is the vertical. Uh, make sure that we're on the right antenna and I can transmit. SWR, or CW. Oh, SWR is pretty high. But I'm also pretty high in the band. I'm not sure where that thing is tuned. Uh, obviously pretty low. See the SWR going down, 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 and they're not supposed to do this. Are you transmitting? <coughs> uh, okay, I must have that pretty short. Okay, so we go to lower side band. Uh, actually, let's go back to CW. And I want to transmit, make sure we get the power out. 100 watts power out. SWR. Right there. No SWR to speak to. So we're on the vertical. You go back to lower side bin. Lower side bin. Exit upper side bin. Lower side bin. Uh, got some weird spikes here. Weird something or others. Let's go back to antenna one, which is my fan dipole. And I got these things going again. Not sure what those are. Now I'll go to 10 meters. Uh, let's see, antenna 2 is cut for 10 meters. If my radials are still working, we'll see. Can I transmit SWR? Yeah, I got low SWR. Power output. 100 watts. So we're tuned for this. SWR is pretty low, less than 1.5. Uh, now the interesting thing is when I saw before, when I go to antenna uh, one, now I need to actually go over to my inverted L, my 160 and 80 meter inverted L. To do that, I just reach over here and switch this to there. And then we go back to antenna one because that's where that one's connected. And go back to the upper side bin, and I was seeing spikes here before, but now I'm not seeing anything. So, which is expected because it's not cut for uh, 10 meters. It's cut for 80 and 160. 1.8. <coughs>
Anyway. Okay, I'm gonna... All right, uh, we'll come back and revisit this. Yeah.